This is a quick introduction to the Beaker browser. Beaker is a peer-to-peer -peer web browser that lets you create and share websites and files from your device. To get started with it, you click the browser menu and select New Website. You'll enter a title for your site and optionally a description, and this will create a new folder in the Sites directory. I'm going to add an index.html to my site to say Hello World. Well, that looks good to me. So I'm going to publish the files to my site, and now it's ready to share. I can give this URL to any other user, and they'll download it from my computer. Beaker includes new web APIs for reading and writing files on the peer-to-peer -peer network. This makes it possible to create new kinds of applications that live entirely on the user's device and don't require any remote services. We call these thick web applications. Here I've written a little app that can read its own files and display them on the page. In Beaker, we also have something called forking. Perhaps you visit a site and you think, eh, I really need to make a change. Well, in normal browsers, you'd be out of luck, but in Beaker, you can fork the site. And now I can set the text to green, which is obviously much better. Now, we're pretty big fans of Markdown, especially because it's so useful for writing documentation. So we've included Markdown rendering natively in Beaker. That means you can write an index.md, and it will render just like an HTML file. If you need a navigation in your Markdown site, you could write a nav.md file, and Beaker will insert it into every page. To help speed up the development process, Beaker includes a live reloading tool. Turn it on to have your page automatically refresh any time a file changes. Beaker is also a great way to share personal files. Your recipient downloads the files directly from your computer and has to know the URL to decrypt and download the files. That makes it incredibly convenient for sharing personal information with friends, family, and colleagues. Beaker is available right now. It's free to download and it's under the MIT open source license.